Here is your latest end time news from tradcatnight.blogspot.com. Ladies and gentlemen, get to Tradcatnight on a daily basis. Spend 15 plus minutes a day, 15 plus blogs going out on a daily basis, keeping you up to date on all of the latest end time news as we head closer to the fruition of the third secret of Fatima, the formalized one world Luciferian new age religion in Rome, and of course, Planet X's incoming. The Planet X system is indeed headed our way, and things are about to get ugly. For this particular segment, we're going to stay within the realm of geopolitics, wars, and rumors of wars. Many of you have been probably following this over the past 24 hours or so, situation going on in the Red Sea with Yemen. This is ongoing. Developing missiles have been fired at the United States warships in the Red Sea for a third time Within a week, multiple missiles were fired Saturday at three U.S. warships in the Red Sea, though none was hit and there were no casualties, the United States military said amidst rising tensions with Yemen's Houthi rebels. It's unclear how many of the surface-to-surface missiles were fired at the USS Mason, interesting name there, USS Nietzsche, and USS Ponce. Uh, Now, the Mason destroyer, which was sailing in international waters off Yemen's coast earlier this week, used unspecified countermeasures against the incoming missiles, the officials said. We are aware of the reports and we are assessing the situation. All of our ships and crews are safe and unharmed, another U.S. defense official said. Well, there you have it. The ongoing saga developing there in Yemen. Of course, there's a saga developing over there in uh, over by North Korea, in uh, Asia, Pacific waters. We, of course, have the situation in Syria. So we see the mounting tensions rising worldwide. Again, I've been warning for years, it's all a game to unite humanity. That is the end game. The war on terror farce, World War Three, is being used to stage the formalized one world religion folks it will indeed uh get ugly i have no doubt about it i recently had on mr engdahl and it was of his opinion that it wouldn't come to war essentially but i disagree with that i think it's going to be get very ugly you'll probably see a false peace treaty first and after that law of silence i think it will break out now make sure you subscribe to tradcat night right now here on youtube Make sure, uh, for those who have subscribed in the past, check again to make sure you're still subscribed because what YouTube is now doing is they're unsubscribing people. Those channels who are exposing the New World Order, if you will, Zionism, and a lot of the things that are going on today. And so you got to make sure you're actually still connected. So please sure you do that. Again, we're keeping you up to date on all the latest videos, news, information, and radio shows. The radio shows are Monday through Friday. Special guests continuing on here through October And I have plans to continue on into November. Uh, So bookmark tradcatnight.blogspot.com. If you're a website owner, make sure you add us onto your page. Again, we're the number one ranked traditional Catholic website worldwide. Top 30,000 website. Uh, Poll question is up along the right-hand side, which will continue on until Election Day. Make sure you participate. The blog archive. Many of you are missing this section. Now, there's two ways you can really access information, specific information, If you're looking for a certain subject, whether it's Planet X or let's say Illuminati, go to Google, type in Tradcat Knight, and then that word you're looking for, whether it's Illuminati, whether it's Planet X, and then you'll ultimately get the top 10 hits or so. You can do it that way. Or again, the blog archive, which is about one third of the way down the page, there's like 5,500 blogs, I believe now. So you simply go in there and just spend time. Click the ones that you're interested in. Uh, Make sure you're sharing information. That's truly what I need help in right now. So in terms of how you can help this apostle, of course, prayer, of course, donations. For those who don't want to go the PayPal route, send me uh, your cash check or money order inquiries to apostleofmaryathotmail.com. Please continue to keep spreading word and info. There's still a lot of people who are unaware that we're out there. Uh, And then lastly, I need uh, your articles, uh, what you're seeing in terms of information, blogs, videos, send them to me, radio shows, suggestions as well. I need more help in that area. That will 
help free up more time for me for research and getting out additional blogs. Until next time, ladies and gentlemen, stay safe and God bless.